Hey y'all, hey, look, I was considering going to a concert here in Arizona. Usher was coming in town in November, okay? Tickets are on sale now. The initial prices are like 160, 170 or something, you know what I'm saying? And I was going to get the ticket until I saw the markup that these ticket companies are charging for processing fees. I want to know what they processing. A hundred percent solid gold? Are you going to get the gold to cover what I'm... What are you doing? Are you printing this on solid gold ticket? Because... Nowadays, you don't even get a paper ticket anymore. You get a ticket to your email or your phone text message and you scan the joint at the daggone place now. So you can't say that you need to get tickets printed. So what's the processing fees, companies? Ticketmaster, Ticketmaster, anybody, anybody that's following me who have worked in that industry, tell me what those $137 worth of processing fees took the tickets up to $242 in nosebleed. You got me fucked up. And you, a person that doesn't know better would blame Usher. But I ain't blaming Usher. I'm blaming these ticket companies that got bots to go out and buy up all the tickets and then they upcharge it by $137 and say it's processing fees. What you're doing is paying the technicians who built those bots to buy up all the tickets. That's what the 137 because it ain't going to Usher. Usher's getting that base 160 whatever. That's what he's getting. The 200 of the $137 markup, that's, I'm calling out Ticketmaster, Vivo, Video, Vivid, Tickets, all cheap tickets, all them for the processing fees. What is it for? Please tell me what the ticket processing fee of 130 motherfucking dollars is worth. What are you processing? What are you processing? And you better break it down good because I work in a business office. So I take credit cards all day. Okay? I take electronic payments all day. And none of my people, none of my credit card companies is charging a hundred a motherfucking thirty-seven dollars for a hundred and sixty-something dollar ticket. Okay? So miss me that is credit card fees. So who you paying? Who you paying? Everything is electronic. I bet there ain't even people on the other end to process it. Okay, so anybody, I'm asking anybody, anybody who knows the ticket companies and what the process is, break it down so it makes sense. Make it make motherfucking sense to your auntie why there's a $137 processing fee to see Usher when the tickets are originally are 160 nigga. What are you processing? What are you processing, Ticketmaster? Vivid Tickets or whatever the ticket company is. What are you processing? I want a statement. A breakdown. Not a statement like you post something on t Twitter, which I don't, I'm not on. I need a breakdown of everything you're charging me in that processing fee. That makes me want to call the ticket company, which they probably don't have a phone number that I can call. Okay? And ask somebody. And if even if they did, they're going to have customer service overseas. So, therefore, you're serving money, saving money on getting cheap labor in countries that, on in, from developing countries. Okay, number one. So, you can't tell me that it's the people you're hiring. Okay? You paying them a dollar per customer service to know nothing about what I have to ask in a language 
where I barely can understand their English. No offense. Thank you. Those who work for those. I'm not, you, I'm just, I'm just keeping it 100. Nothing against those people who work. I'm glad you got a job. I'm glad they're providing you a job. Okay. You could do better. They could pay you better. You can get paid a whole lot more in America. I see why y'all come over here in the, in the boats. You know, you come over here, you can get paid more because we demand more as a country. Okay. We're not paying people 25 cents anymore an hour to answer the phone. Not that that's what you're doing. I don't know. I'm, okay. Anyway, I, 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 I didn't venture over to where I could be offending some people. I'm sorry. Okay. But wh who you're paying? Wh who's getting paid this $137? What is that going to? What do you have to? Are you walking it over to the credit card coming to Visa and MasterCard? Are you going from state to state? Are you taking it in a car to tell them here's the money? What what what's the process? What what was that? What are you processing? You're not even giving us paper tickets. What are you processing? At least back in the day, I could understand you had to print the tickets. You got to, you know what I'm saying? You, the artwork on the tick on the ticket. If you have the picture of the artist or stuff like that, I get that. Okay, you got to print them out. You got to go to a printer. They charge a certain amount. So I, that part I get. You don't do that no more. You send me a, a, a QR code to my phone and they scan it. Y'all, y'all got your auntie messed up. I won't be seeing Usher this year. Okay. Or any year where he's in his prime. I have to wait until he's on his 70s. In his 70s, he's doing a, a, a Lovers and Friends oldie but goodie show. And the tickets is 50 bucks. Or maybe 100 bucks. Okay. With a processing fee of maybe $25. That is. I, 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 you could tell your girl have not paid for a concert. Of that magnitude, okay. If Chris Brown came with those prices, and I, mm -mm, Chris Brown, I will enjoy your music at home sensationally, okay. <laughs> All right, I go. I love you. Aton, stop. Send it back. Send it back. Send it back. I'm doing this. Send it back. Send it back. I ain't buying them tickets. Aton, stop. Lean back. Lean back. Then thunder clap. Thunder clap. Be back. Okay, that's what I'm doing. That's what I'm doing. Goddamn. You must be fucking crazy. Not Usher. I would pay $162 to see Usher. Hell, I might have second guessed and thought about maybe if I move some things around, if that $242 for that ticket, total ticket, was going to Usher. Okay, those processing fees ain't going to Usher. Usher is worth $242 if he was getting that whole thing. Okay, I'll sooner walk to Georgia now. Knock on Usher's door and say, yo, can you do your auntie a favor? I will call, I will find his number and call him up first. I don't know it. And I, you know, don't do it. I'm not going to do that. But I'm just saying, now nah, I'll do that first. I say, hey, Usher, hi. This is your auntie, your car. How you doing? How you doing? Yeah, remember we used to be in love with homegirl back in the day? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Um, yeah, 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 yeah. I need a ticket. I ain't going to be greedy and ask for a ticket for too many other people but me. Give me a ticket. You don't have to, you don't have to, I don't have to be front row. You don't have to sweat on me. You don't have to dance up against me. But I ain't got no man that's going to be mad or nothing if you do. Okay? If I pay that type of money, nigga, Usher better come up to nosebleed and sing for me by myself. Fuck everybody else sitting next to me. 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 I'm your boo. Nigga, I pay that. I'm your boo. For life. For life. For life.